Hi friends, today's topic of discussion is from the chapter Polynomial and this is the exercise or practice set 3.1. In earlier video we have done question number 1, in this video we will be doing question number 2 and question number 3. So here let us see first the question number 2. Here it is asked to write the coefficient of m cube. The coefficient is the number or the constant which is along with the variable and the variable can have various powers. So here in this polynomial, the given polynomials, we need to see the variable m cube and we have to write the coefficient or the number or the constant which is along with it and we have to write its sign also. When we talk about coefficient, it is not only the number but also its sign. So let us see the first one. Here it is written m cube. Here there is no number written but here it is 1. Okay. So here the coefficient of m cube we can see that is 1. Okay. And here if we see minus 3 by 2 plus m minus root 3 m cube. So the coefficient with m cube is minus root 3. So the coefficient with minus with m cube is minus root 3. Okay. So that is the number along with its sign. So now the third one is given minus 2 upon 3 m cube minus 5 m square plus 7 m minus 1. Here the number or the constant or the coefficient along with m cube is minus 2 by 3. So it is minus 2 by 3. So here we got the coefficient of m cube as 1 because here there is no number written but it is assumed as 1 or taken as 1. So this is 1. Okay, so the coefficient of m cube is 1. Here minus 3 by 2 plus m minus root 3 m cube. So the number, the coefficient okay, or the constant along with m cube is minus root 3. So minus root 3 becomes the coefficient. And for here minus 2 by 3 m cube. So the number, the coefficient or the constant along with m cube is minus 2 by 3. That's why the coefficient is minus 2 by 3. So now let us do the question number 3. Here we need to write the polynomial in x using the given information. So here we will form a polynomial and the variable will be x as per the given question. Here there is no single answer. There can be many answers but in the examination you have to write one. So here they have asked a monomial with degree 7. So it is simple as that we can write x raised to 7. So this is a monomial which is having a degree 7. Okay. If somebody wants, he can also write as 2 x raised to 7. This is also a monomial with degree 7. So there can be many answers like minus root 3 x raised to 7. This is also a monomial with degree 7. So here we have taken up a very simple example that is x raised to 7. That is the monomial with degree 7. Then binomial with degree 35. So Degree 35 means the maximum power okay, of the variable is 35. So we can say x raised to 35 plus 10. This is one of the example where we can take x raised to 35 plus 10. Because here it becomes binomial because there are two terms and the maximum power of the variable is 35. Here there can be various answers for example 2 x raised to 35 plus x raised to 24 and so on. So you can have many combinations but here we have taken a simple one that is x raised to 35 plus 10 which is a binomial where the degree is 35. Now trinomial with degree 8. Here we will take another simple example that is x raised to 8 plus x raised to 4 plus 5. So as you can see this is trinomial 1, 2, 3 terms and the maximum power of the variable is 8 that is degree 8 and here also we can have various solution like x raised to 8 plus 2 x raised to 5 plus 3 x square and so on. So we have taken a very simple example of a trinomial x raised to 8 plus x raised to 4 plus 5. So here we have solved two problems okay, from practice set 
In next video, we will solve further problems of practice set 3.1 and further practice sets. Hope you like the video. We will again meet in the next video very soon. Till then, goodbye.